Welcome to the Vaishnav Chakra Relaxation. It will take you step by step into the core of existence. state of consciousness far beyond anxieties, a place of trust and harmony. According to my personal experience, this meditation is best done in a lying position so please feel free to lie down comfortably, if necessary, covered by a blanket. It's very relaxing to feel the heaviness of your body, supported by Mother Earth, releasing tension with every outgoing breath. Prithivi Tvayadrita Luka Devi Tvam Vishnunadrita Tvam Cha Darayamam Nityam Pavitram Cha Asanam Kuru O Prithivi Devi, Mother Earth, you support all the world's people and Sri Vishnu sustains you. O Goddess, please always support me and sanctify this sitting place. The second chakra, the water element, now sensing the fluids, liquids, waters flowing through your body with every heartbeat and purifying them by inviting the graceful presence of the holy rivers. Gange cha yamuna chaiva Kudavari Saraswati Namada Sindhu Kaveri Jalesmin Sanidim Kuru O Ganga, Yamuna, Godavari, O Sarasvati, O Narmada, 
Sindhu or Kaveri, please become present in this water. Third chakra, the solar plexus chakra, the fire element. Enlighten your three bodies, material, subtle and soul, by remembering the holy key lamp fire offered to the Supreme Divine. Svaprakasha Mahatija Sarvatastamirapa Sabayapyantara Jutia Deepoyam Pratigriyatam O Bhagavan this lamp is endowed with an immense effulgence. It removes all darkness and illuminates both internally and externally. Please accept this lamp. its warmth and electricity all throughout your body, entering through your eyes, floating over your face. Through your arms, into the tips of your fingers. and then from your chest down into your feet. Then rising up again on the back of the legs. your spine and the back of your head. Completing the circle on your nose. Thus cradling you in a golden cocoon of divine light. The Heart Chakra, Part A, the Air Element, purifying your heart and feelings by sensing the touch of air on your skin and inside your respiratory tract, remembering the gentle winds that have touched 
the body of the Supreme Divine. Tasya Ravinda Nayanasya Padaravinda Kinjal Kamishra Tulasi Makarandavayu Antargata Svavivarena Chakara Tesham Sankshobam Akshara Jusham Apichitta Tanvo When the breeze carrying the aroma of tulasi leaves and saffron from the lotus feet of the lotus-eyed personality of Godhead entered through the nostrils into the hearts of the four Kumaras, they experienced a blissful change in both body and mind, even though they were attached to the impersonal Brahman understanding. The fifth chakra, throat chakra, ether and sound element, making your existence auspicious by remembering the most auspicious sound of the bell used in worship of the Supreme. Sarva Vatya Mai Gante Deva Nivasya Ballave Tamvina Naiva Sarvisham Shubham Bhavati Shobhane O oh, beautiful bell, you embody the sweet sound of all music and you are dear to the God of Gods, Sri Krishna. Without you, there is no auspiciousness for anyone. Sixth Chakra, the Third Eye Chakra, the Mind Element. Now aligning your mind with the highest loving inspiration. Mama Mana Mandire, Rahani Shirin, Krishna Murari, Sri Krishna Murari. O Krishna Murari, O Sri Krishna Murari, please abide in the temple of my heart both day and night. Seventh Chakra, Crown Chakra, purifying your intelligence. 
Yasyatma Buddhi Kuna Pe Tridadu Ke Svadi Kaladrad Shu Bauma Ichari Yathirta Buddhi Sali Nakari Chich Jane Vabige Shu Saeva Gokara One who considers his gross body to be himself but does not identify himself as a devotee of the Lord. Who considers wife, family and associated paraphernalia to be his possessions. Yet does not feel affection or attachment for a devotee of the Lord. Who considers a graven image of earth or other substance to be God, yet does not conceive of the worshipable position of a devotee of the Lord. Who considers some river or lake to be a holy place of pilgrimage, yet does not perceive a devotee of the Lord to be the abode of divinity is an ass among cows, a colossal fool. Now returning to the inner chambers of the heart chakra. 1. The conditioned soul. Krishna Buli Jeev Anadi Bhayamoka Ataeva Mayatare Deya Sangsara Dukkha. Forgetting Krishna, the living entity has been attracted by the external feature from time immemorial. Therefore, the illusory energy, Maya, gives him all kind of misery in form of his karma and his material existence. Second, God's mercy comes in time as Guru, who is an external manifestation of the Super Soul dwelling in the heart. Pramanda Brahmite Kon Bhagyavanjeev Guru Krishna Prasade Pai Bhakti Lata Beach. After being born and reborn again and again throughout the entire material creation, some fortunate soul may, by the grace of Krishna and the Guru, be given the seed of the creeper of devotional service. The Guru then teaches us to know our real self. 
જનરલ સંબંધ ત્રિવેરા સ્વરૂપ હોય કૃષ્ણેરા નિત્યદાસ કૃષ્ણેરા તટસ્થ શક્તિ વેદ વેદ પ્રકાશ By nature, in his essence, the living entity is the eternal servant of God, Krishna. He is Krishna's marginal potency, simultaneously one and different from the Lord. Now, following the rhythm of your heartbeat, 
with this meditation in mind, chanting the names of the Supreme Divine Couple. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna.